Hello everyone, so this time I'm going to discuss the lesson 3, solving problems involving something distribution of the sample means. So we have two Z formulas to be used in this lesson. So first is the Z formulas for the fun sample and Z formula for the population. So ito yung sample mean, population mean, population standard deviation, sample size, and X for the given measurement. So ang population, Z score of the population, na introduce na natin yung sa mga previous discussion natin. So ang U is ang Z formula for the sample. So example 1. The average time it takes a group of college students to complete a certain examination is 46.2 minutes. The standard deviation is 8 minutes. Assume that the variable is normally distributed. So, ang given na average or ang mean is ilang? 42.6 minutes. Ang given na standard deviation, standard deviation is 8 minutes. So first, what is the probability that a randomly selected college student will complete the examination in less than 30 minutes? So since tatlo lang ang given na uh, given na data. So take note, ang pag-solve ani niya is same sa previous na mga discuss discussion about Kung sa probability distribution. Okay. So, ang uh, given. So, lagta na ito ang given. Ang population mean, kaning dari as a main na problem is 46.2. Ang uh, standard deviation is 8. Then, ang given na measurement natin dito is 30. So, since tatlo lang ang given, so ito yung gagamitin natin ang sa population na z-score. So, z equals 30 minus 46.2 divided by standard deviation na 8. So, z equals negative 2 point okay, minus natin. 30 minus 46.2. Negative 16.2 divided by 8. So, the answer will be negative 2.03. So, Z equals negative 2.03. So, our area is maasa mali siya makita sa so negative 2.0 and 0 0.03. So, the area will be 0.0212 So since ang given is less than So automatic ang area of ang probability is same 0.0214 or 2.12% So almost the same lang na siya sa previous na lesson So since problem solving so, in your final conclusion is the probability that a randomly selected college student will complete the examination in less than 30 minutes is 0.0212 or 2.12%. Or pwede din 2.12% is the probability that a randomly selected college student will complete the examination in less than 30 minutes. Pwede din ganun ang conclusion. Okay, next letter B. So, letter B, if 50 randomly selected, if 50 randomly selected college students take the examination, what is the probability that the mean time it takes the group to complete the test will be in less than 30 minutes? So, nanan siya sample na 50. Paano kung 50 lang daw ka estudyante ang ga, ang ipatake sa exam? So, what is the probability na mahuman nila in less than 43 minutes? So, ang given, naman ang given ang mean. So, same gihapon, ang population mean, nagdita ang diri, 
46.2, ang standard deviation is 8. Then, uh, sample size is 50 since nagkuha out sa whole college students na population, nagkuha lang man of 50. So, natay sample size na 50. And, ang uh, given measurement or the uh, sample mean is 43. Okay. So, I substitute sa formula ng Z formula for the sample. So, Z equals sample mean minus population mean over standard deviation divided by square root of N. So, 43 minus 46.2 divided by 8 over square root of 50. So, Z equals, or direction na nato lang ha. So, 43 minus 46.2 divided by 8 square root of 50. Then, round of two decimal places, negative 2.83. Z equals... Negative 2.83. So, pag kuwao na nga iya, kita na siya sa negative 2.8 at 0 0.8. So, pila ang area ani? Area. Isulat. So, 2.8. Negative 2.8. 0. Point 0.023 0.0023 So since I'm given is less than So ang area of probability Parisas So ang probability is 0.0023 Or 0.23% so, ang conclusion, so, ang conclusion is the probability that the mean time it takes the group to complete the test will be in less than 43 minutes is 0.0023 or 0.23%. Okay, next, example 2. Example 2, the average number of milligrams of cholesterol in a cup of a certain brand of ice cream is 660 milligrams. And the standard deviation is 35 milligrams. So, assume the variable is normally distributed. So, sa second example, ang average or ang mean sa cholesterol content sa isa ka cup of ice cream is 660 milligrams. And ang given na standard deviation is 35 milligrams. So, question letter A. If a cup of ice cream is selected, what is the probability that cholesterol content will be more than 670 milligrams? So, pila do ang probability na mas daghan pa sa 670 milligram ang cholesterol content sa isa ka cup na ice cream. Okay, so ang given, so isulat na to ang given. So, ang population mean is, pila man to, average 660 mg. Ang standard deviation is 35 mg. Then, ang given na scores, so since population ato ang i- I compute kasi wala may sample, sample size na given so 670 so gamit ang formula sa z score of a population z equals x minus mean over standard deviation so 670 minus 660 over 35 so, Z equals Z and Z. So, 670 divided by I minus 660 is 10. 
10 divided by 35. 0 0.29. Round off to decimal places. 0 0.29. So, makita na siya sa 0 0.2, 0 0.09. So, ti ang area. Ti ang area, ano? 0 0.2 and 0 0.09. 0 0.20. Zero point six one four one. Zero point six one four one. Then since probability ang gipangutan na, so i compute na to ang probability. So ang given is more than. So di ba sa previous lesson na to, pag more than or uh, synonym sa more than, greater than, na Basta ang graph padulong sa right, magamit ka of 1. Above, more than, greater than, at least, and so on, so magamit ka of 1. 1 minus sa area. 0 0.6141. So, the probability... One minus point six one four one zero point three eight five nine zero point three eight five nine or on a convert into percent move thirty eight point fifty nine percent. So conclusion the pro the probability that the cholesterol content will be more than 670 mg is 0 0.3859 or 38.59%. So, take note ha, sa example 1, ang given is less than or synonym sa less than. Basta ang, ang shaded portion sa distribution is padulong sa left. Padulong siya sa left. So, ang example 2. So, ang given is more than or ang dis ang shaded portion sa region sa distribution padulong sa right. Almost the same lang ihang process. Ang nadagdag lang is sample. Under lang siya sa sample. So, katong sa previous na discussion is under siya sa population. Okay. So, ako ang given is between, syempre, i-minus e mo ang duha ka area. Then, kung more than, magamit ka of 1, sing sa itong mo, i-minus ni mo ang area. 1 minus area. Pag uh, between, ang duha ka area, i-minus. Pag less than, mas sayon kay Kung sa itong given area, mo lang yapon ang probability. Okay, next, B. If a sample of 10 cups, or naanay, sample size. 10 cups of ice cream is selected. What is the probability that a mean of the sample will be larger than 670 milligrams? So, ang given na to the same, 660 ang population mean. Ang population standard deviation is 35. Then, <laughs> ang sample size is 10 cups. And ang populate, ang sample mean, so mean of a sample, so sample mean is 670. So substitute sa formula ng sample, z score of the sample, z equal x ma, uh, sample mean over population mean over population standard deviation para sa so, 670 minus 660. 670 minus 660 divided by uh, 35 over square root of 10. So, Z equals, oh, insult na natin ha sa calculator. Then, ang final answer, i round off two decimal places. So, 670 minus 660 divided by 
35 over square root of 10. So the answer is 0 0.90. I did it somewhere around 0 0.90. Positive. 0 0.90. So, siya makita sa 0 0.9 of 0 0.07. Okay. So, ang area. So, pangitaon ang area. 0 0.9. 0 0.8159. 0 0.8159. So, probability. Since naaman siya yung larger, so padulong sa right ang shaded portion. So probability, so magamit ito, 1, 1 minus 0 0.8159. So the answer, 1 minus 0 0.8159. 0 0.181. Or, kung i percent right, 80.41. Kung i sa percent, move lang like two decimal places. So, yun na. Then, since problem solving, so na ay conclusion. So, ang conclusion, since ang question is, what is the probability? So, the probability that a mean of the sample will be larger than 670 milligram is 0.5. 1841 or 18.41%. So, just in case sa uh, ating uh, quiz or activity na ay between, kasi sa discussion walay between. So, just in case na ay between na given, same lang siyang process sa previous ha, pag between, eh, minus lang ang duha ka uh, duha, eh, minus lang ang duha ka area. Anak lang.